everyone, it's been a while, but I've returned from the far off lands of Westeros, which is code for my apartment. Unfortunately, I don't actually live in Westeros. However, we have a ton of news today. We're giving away a console and you get to see my ugly sweater slash sweatshirt. So let's get to the news. Kingdom Hearts 3 is on the way, but what's taking so long? In an interview with IGN, the game's co-director, Taiya Sue, said that switching to the Unreal Engine 4 technology took some getting used to, and half the team was busy working on the 2.5 remix. But fear not, now that Kingdom Hearts 2.5 is done, everyone will be focused on the new sequel. IGN also asked him if Star Wars was going to appear in the game, seeing how it's owned by Disney and all. He said, I can't really go into any specifics or say anything about Star Wars, but when we come up with worlds, we really want variety and to make sure that there's a lot of different types of worlds. Any world that looks special is definitely a consideration. Well, it's not a no. The numbers are in, and the Xbox One beat out the PS4 as the best-selling console for November. Microsoft said that November also set a new record for Xbox One sales, which probably means that there will be a lot of Xbox Ones under Christmas trees this year. As for software, the top three selling games of the month were Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, Grand Theft Auto V, and Super Smash Bros. However, Nintendo was also quick to point out that if you combine sales of both Pokemon Alpha Sapphire and Pokemon Omega Ruby, Pokemon would easily be one of the best selling games of the month. In the first 10 days, the new Pokemon sold nearly 1.5 million copies. That's right, people love their Pokemons. The Federal Communications Commission made a new decision that may raise internet speeds for certain areas. Without going into too much detail, any company that uses the Connect America Fund to build broadband networks will have download speeds of 10 megabits per second. That's quite the upgrade because the previous requirement was 4 megabits per second. Once again, this only affects companies that use government-sponsored Connect America money but hopefully it'll push for faster speeds for everyone. And it's my favorite day of the week, Friday, which means it's giveaway time. Today we're giving away a console of your choice and the season pass of Telltale's Game of Thrones series. All you have to do is answer this question. If you had a dragon, what would you do with it? A question I often ponder. Fill out the form at the link below and leave your answer in the comments section. And guess what? That's your fix for December 12th. I'm Alexis Kazambalidis and you can get your fix here anytime online at IGN.